set to go. Ready? And racing and jumping best there as Ebony uh, plays along there without point out. Getting around the outside, Billy Marlowe also pushing up as drifting along and not too far away. Getting a good run through his home bush. Gracie wide on the track now. Trick Me Vara gets into the race. So does Alan Custom. Back now we go to a Corborn Jacko. Up they come. Centre track. Billy Marlowe makes it two. We'll get there from Trick Me Vara. has gone a good race. Here we go to Anna Custom. Got to third ahead of the home bush. Gracie Ebony Hayes. And then we go here too on crossing. Drifting along Pickering and Corborn Jacko. Didn't pick that up in the call. That's uh, finished up in about the third to last spot. <music> Set to go. Ready. And racing into jumping best the inside here is Big Time on fire along there with Big Time lights going up and even wider Big Time Muslin going up to make a line of four there was uh, Big Time Fever. Bit of trouble though going into the first corner so Big Time Fever comes out in front there of Corborn Muzza. Just on the inside we go to Meteor Veg back in the field to Big Time Spirit looking to run there with Big Time Light now getting back in the field is Kylan and also back there is Magic Maria down the side they come and doing it okay Big Time Fever just in behind Corborn Muzzers and right there and also the inside Big Time on fire it's a charge and right through the centre, Corborn Muzz is going to get it. Now, Meteor Veg has arrived home well on the outside in a photo there. Now, we had uh, Big Time Fever, I think, just cramping there. And not far away, the inside, Big Time on fire. And back here we go to a Big Time Spirit. Finding trouble across the top was Big Time Light. Also, Kylan never got into the race. <laughs> Set to go. Ready. And there they go. And uh, jumping best there would have been Allegro Organa along there with Trip to Florida. And right round the outside, Unawares is also burning into it. Even wider, don't mention it, running on. Then we go back here too. But Trip to Florida gets a bit of a shuffle there now with Lily's stopwatch. Now getting back is Gully Screamer also. Allegro Organa's got a shuffle up. They come. Unawares out wide. Don't mention it drives. But Unawares will get there from it. Don't mention it. And uh, very close here for third two. Uh, we had Getting Home Will there. Lenny Stopwatch. Amon was right up there with the uh, trip to Florida. Also Allegro Organa. And also getting back there, we would have had Gully Screamer Camilla back, so just didn't get the jump at all. Set to go, ready. And racing and jumping will the inside here is Corborn uh, Miami along there with Glads are popping and charging up out wide. Corborn Mill trying to come round with it now is Bez New Point and Big Time Bill. Now getting a shuffle now is Falante just going ahead of that. Also getting a shuffle, Glads are popping. Now out the back there we've got Roscoe Action. Bez New Point's got back with Falante across the top. Big Time Bill took over, put three or four on Corborn Mill. Just in behind here we go to Corborn Miami. Break back in the field to Corborn Gable. They go for home. Big Time Bill stepping up to class one and makes it look easy. Gets here from Corborn Mill. Then we go to Corborn Miami. Now fourth is very close. Uh, glad the popping may have taken that off for Corborn Gable. That's close. Then we go back here to uh, Bez New Point, Falante, and just up ahead of that Roscoe action. Set to go, ready. And racing and flying out there. Miss Muffet's going to take the early lead now from Act Naturally going out. Artford just in behind. Here we go to Onda Quest getting around the outside. Also there, you bet your bonnie. Back here we go to Last Man Alive. Also, Dilly's too much getting a rails run there now. Up on the inside was you bet your bonnie. And back here to Fashion Fancy. Up they come. Unbeknown gets the lead and will get the win here to beat to Miss Muffet's held down second. I think just there from Act Naturally. They were lining up for fourth. We had Last Man Alive. You bet your bonnie just to run. Set to go. 
and racing and jumped okay to Magic Latte but not as good as Steel the Gold is going to go straight to the lead from Magic Latte around the outside big time Summer also coming across a chip off block just in behind here we go to take action Corborn Lick's got plenty to do back here we go to Opawa Gavin and dropping off Opawa Spice they charge down the back Steel the Gold away by four or five for Lamas and Morris here comes now Magic Latte out of the pack and just in behind chip off block they've got away on a big time Summer and take action they go for home Steel the Gold getting tired down the outside Magic Latte took over and Magic Latte will get there from Steel the Gold. Then we go here to Chip Off Blogger. Take action, we'll get to fourth. Then we go to a Big Time Summer. Just in behind that to a Corborn Lick and Opawa Gavin. And Opawa Spice will tail them in. Ready. And there they go, and she jumped well the inside too, big time lady, but out wide now, uh, Wilt Freak Show's going up, and so is Wong Fillares, the inside here to She's Mustard, trying to get around the outside is Opawa Shiloh, and big time well done, getting back now we go to uh, Ben Nevis Knight, just up ahead of that now, Opawa Shiloh, and making ground there, out wide there was She's Mustard, across the top they come, big time lady clear, three or four on Wong Fillares, trying to get into the race now is big time well done, just in behind Wilt Freak Show, and also She's Mustard, they go for home, big time lady clear, and will race away to win this from big time well done. Then we go to Wong Fuller West. Will Freak Show just holding fourth there from She's Mustard. Opawa Shiloh. And the two at the back of the field would have been Ben Nevis Knight and Corborn, Ohio. Racing and uh, jumping out well there was Wine Bar out wide here on the tractor Rangers Walsh and Mousy Mousy now looking to charge around the outside getting a good run up on the inside is Rally Sirius getting past that though Corborn Jesse Big Time Taylor back here we go to Shin Zigzag and Orange Yellow they go for home the inside Wine Bar the outside Mousy Mousy Wine Bar Wine Bar will get there from Mousy Mousy then we go to I think Rangers Walsh has just grabbed third in the middle though but that's close uh, up there too we had Big Time Taylor Corborn Jesse just in behind uh, Rally Sirius. And also back towards the last two or three, we would have had to shin zigzag. The downgrader didn't get into it. Racing into best beginning out wide sweet loving but there goes Mr Mays driving up and also driving up as big time thinker just in behind lick it up trying to get around the outside as PJ Pringle snowball chance back here we go to Corborn Sticks got back with Typhoon Ted they run the corner send a track Mr Mays the inside giving heart plenty as lick it up Mr Mays flying home there big time thinker I think Mr Mays from big time thinker and uh, very close here for third we had Lick It Up, PJ Pringles was out wide, Corborn Stick was also closing off well, Typhoon Ted not far away. Ready. And racing in a bit slow there. Sub Zero is Mur jumping out best. The inside of Legros Ten Yorn out round the outside comes Opawa Tomo screaming into it just in behind. Here we go to Midnight Enemy. A Sub Zero is Mur making up ground there with Opawa top back. Here we go to Devil Skin the Evening Hell and also Corborn Westy. They go for home. Opawa Tomo took over and races away from Legros Ten Yorn. Then we go to Sub Zero is Mur Midnight Enemy. Then we go back here to Opawa top and towards the back of the field there we would have had uh, Devil Skin. And uh, Evening Hill was also back there on the last two or three. All locked away for race number 11. Set to go, ready.
and racing and jumping best the inside here is Johnny Angel along there with the You Betcha Misty around the outside to hit it off also trying to get into it missing Allegro even wider here to Ruarama back here now Johnny Angel gets back with Corborn Potsy just in behind Kentaro Baxter along there with Buzzy Jim and also back there is Corborn Potsy up they come You Betcha Misty easily gets the win from missing Allegro there we go to Ruarama uh, fourth, just taking my eyes off that. Possibly Ken Taro Baxter getting through there of Buzzy Jim and Johnny Angel. Corborn Potsy didn't get into the race. Was also back there. And Homebush Messi was just up ahead of that. Ready. And racing into jumping will send a track there as Big Fat Gypsy, but there goes Rocky Fox Trot to turn it on and trying to get into the races. Also, Celestial Action gets to third. You betcha, Becky, just in behind here, Sasha McBill. Then we go back to Opava Bucks into Dark Gunner. Out the back, Electric Dandy, they go for home. It's all Rocky Fox Trot races away from Celestial Action. Then we go to Big Fat Gypsy out wide, you betcha, Becky. Then we go here to a Dark Gunner, Opava Bucks towards the back of the field, Sasha McBill and Electric Dandy. Ready. And racing into jumping up will the inside here is Homebush Pippi along there with Lisa Del Marcus and now trying to get into the races. Double like the inside here. Premier Prince also looking to run. You bet Savannah has got plenty to do. Another keys beside that around the outside there. Now we've got to getting into it. Uh, would have been indefinite order. They go for home the inside. Homebush Pippi right down the outside. Premier Prince. Premier Prince will get this very close here for second. Uh, Lisa Del Marcus. Homebush Pippi. Homebush Pippi. Lisa Del Marcus. Nothing in that. Then we've got a line up. We've got uh, double ice getting home. Indefinite order was there. Another the key. You bet your Anna didn't do a great deal. <music> Set to go. Ready. And there they go and jump well. The inside two, Corborn Frost, but not as good as the Viva Levixen. Right round the outside, Sedbrook Assets also charging into it. The inside, Cindy Action. Just in behind here we go to Idle Mark. Sedbrook Assets gets a bit of a shuffle there with Gully Runner. Back in the field now to Botany. Vicky's also got back. They go for home. And in front, Corborn Frost clear and gets there from Viva Levixen. There we go to Cindy Action. Just in behind Idle Mark. Then we go to a Gully Runner. And uh, towards the back of the field there we had a Smart Dandy. And a set for Gasset after a good beginning also ended up back there with Botany Vicky. <music> set to go, ready. And racing into stepping best the reserve there. Magic Dina straight to the front now from which Misty and now driving up on the inside is another realm. Trying to get into the race, the inside is lip it up even wider here too. A Corborn Hint gets into it. Back here we go to Grace Stick, which Misty's got back in the field there with the sunset margin. And also lip it up. Up they come on the reserve. Magic Dina will get there from another realm. Then we go here to a Corborn Hint will grab third. And they got right away on the rest of them. Grace Slick gets to fourth. Then we had that Witch Misty just in behind private action. Sunset margin didn't get into it. And also back towards the tower, we would have had, uh, was it there, the uh, lip it up? Mm -hmm. 